Today I want to talk about how to use the came draw. At the very beginning, we need to select the two core chains right here. And then when you press it and drag it across, it will automatically create a linear carbon chain. If you press and drag it, and at the same time you press control, the bond you're going to create it will follow your mouse movement. So where your mouse move, the bond will be created. If you want to select the molecules, click McQueen tool, and then it will automatically select the molecules. Want to select a specific molecules, select the specific molecules, and then double clicking the bond. The whole molecule will be selected. If you want to select part of the molecules, use the last of two, which is right here, and then only selecting specific part and then the specific part will be selected if you want to copy the specific part drag it while pressing control and it will give you a copy on that you can always use the lasso tool or McQueen tool to drag it anywhere else on the white paper but you can also drag it while clicking shift so that it will be aligned to horizontal or vertically. If you want to make a 1CH3 bond right here, you can select the solid bond tool and then click the common atom right here, it will automatically give you one bond. Clicking it twice, it will give you two bonds. Or simply use the cursor to the carbon atoms and then press 0 for one bond, press 9 for two bonds and press three for three bonds. If you want to make a double bond, use the solid bond tool and move to the bond and then pressing two will be a double bond, three will be a triple bond and four will be a quadruple bond. If you want to change the atoms, say I don't want to be a carbon, I want it to be a solver, select the carbon atom and then you press, you press S will be solver. P will be phosphorus, O will be oxygen, and obviously N will be nitrogen. And if you highlighting uh, one of the bonds, and then you press 5, it will give you 5 membrane, for 6 will be 6 membrane, 7 will be 7 membrane, 8 membrane, and 9 membrane. If you want to add lone pair electrons on the oxygen, select the tools right here called chemical symbols, and then select the lone pair electrons. Click one will give you one lone pair electron. And then click for twice, two lone pairs electrons. If you want to have an arrow to indicate the reactions, I can select the arrows in the arrows tool. Press it and drag it, and will give you an arrow. Of course, you can also use the text tool right here, so that you can always add the reactants and conditions on or below the arrows. I hope it helps and uh, remember to like or subscribe our YouTube channel if you find it useful. And here again, thanks for watching.